Hi everybody, Andy here with eTrailer.com and today we're going to take a look at this Gladiator waterproof cargo net with integrated tarp and cam buckle tie downs. This heavy duty cargo net is going to let you secure and protect the cargo in your truck bed, doing a great job of protecting your cargo from the elements. We do have several sizes of this cargo net available depending on your truck bed size and on your screen I I am listing the different sizes that we have. For our time together, I am using the eight foot long by six foot and nine inch wide cargo net, and that's going to be great for your standard bed truck. But depending on the size that you are looking for, just take the item number that you see there on your screen associated with the size that would work best for you, put it in the search field of our website, and it will take you to that particular size. But I do want to stress that everything that we're going to look at with this uh, cargo net today is going to be true of those other cargo nets. The only real difference is going to be the size that it's uh, that it comes in. Now this cargo net, as I mentioned and as you can see, has an integrated tarp that's waterproof. It's constructed of vinyl and the webbing covered 18 gauge vinyl is going to give you ample surface contact with your cargo and the tripled layered reinforced um, edges are going to give you extra strength and the webbing and the vinyl is going to resist uh, tears and cuts and punctures and I have to say I am very impressed with the build quality uh, of this cargo net. Sometimes you can get a tarp and it feels very thin or flimsy like it could tear easily. That is definitely not the case with this Gladiator cargo net. Uh, this integrated tarp is very durable. It's very strong. I think it would take a lot for this to puncture or tear or rip so I don't think uh, you're going to have to worry about this um, uh, getting torn easily at all. I'm very impressed with the qualities. There's a good weight to it and a good thickness to it as well. It is also UV stabilized to prevent fading and degradation from sunlight and this uh, cargo net does feature grommets uh, that's going to give you versatile flexible tie down points and these grommets can be found along the edge and uh, the inner joints and uh, the number of grommets will vary depending on the size of the cargo net that you get but they're going to offer you multiple tie down points it's going to be great for use on your smaller loads or your larger loads. I do want to point out that the, these uh, net cargo nets are not stretchable. Um, they are um, very um, durable. So um, if you think that you're going to get one of these and be able to make it stretch to cover any deficit of length or width um, that you're needing, that's not going to be the case. So again, you want to make sure that you get the appropriate size that you need. The webbing width is an inch and a half. And these cargo nets have a safe working load limit of 700 pounds with a maximum load or brake strength of 2,100 pounds. Now zooming in here on the center of my table, I wanted to show you that these nets do, these cargo nets also include uh, these cam buckle straps. And we have on one end a quick snap carabiner. And then on the other end here, we have these vinyl coated or these rubber coated uh, end hooks, these J style end hooks. So that coating is going to protect the surface of whatever you hook these to. And these spring loaded cams, uh, cam buckles are going to make it very easy to um, adjust the uh, strap to the appropriate length that's going to be best for you. And then the buckles are going to uh, hold it uh, secure. The um, maximum length of each of these straps is 34 inches and the width is an inch and a half wide and each of these straps have a safe working load limit of 1,323 pounds and a maximum load or brake strength of 3,969 pounds. Now zooming out here I also wanted to show you this um, zippered storage bag 
This bag is also um, very durable, made, uh, uh, very, uh, made to be very rugged, and you're not going to have to worry about it easily ripping. And it's a great practical thing to have um, to store this cargo net and the straps when you're not using it. So just opening up our front panel here, that is going to allow you to put in your cargo net and uh, your straps if you choose to put the straps there. We also have this um, window pocket here at the front. And then on the back, we have um, more compartments. We have these slide-in pockets that you can throw in, something that you need to have easy and quick access to. And then a zippered pouch. You can maybe throw the straps into the zippered pouch here at the back. Whatever you throw in there, just zip it up and it'll be secure in there. Now this tarp, as I mentioned, is uh, rather large. It's uh, eight foot long by uh, six foot nine inches wide. And so it would take some time for me to uh, fold this up for you. But uh, I did um, do a video on the smaller version of this um, cargo net. Um, and as you can see, and I wanted to show you uh, just how this does fold up and that it will in fact fit into the bag. Obviously I sped this up a little bit. I typically don't move that fast, but I just wanted to give you an idea that um, this can be folded up relatively easily. It's a, it can be, uh, you might uh, benefit from having somebody else with you on the larger ones, depending on which size you get. But there's really no wrong or w right way to fold these. You can just uh, get it to the size it's going to uh, work to fit in that bag and it's going to slide in. The bag is a little bit expandable. And again, the overall quality of the uh, cargo net and uh, of the bag, they're just very, uh, very good, very robust. And I think that they're gonna give you many, um, many years of great service. So if you're looking for an all-in-one load restraint system, and uh, you're looking um, to uh, keep your cargo protected from the elements, these cargo nets are going to be a great item for you to consider. Well, that's going to conclude our look today. I do hope that it was helpful for you. Again, my name is Andy. Thank you for joining me.